So what's going on everyone, my name is Mr. Dalek JD. thank you very much for clicking on this video and today we have a world exclusive, I'm sure you can see this by now, that we have the world's very first Advanced Warfare Xbox One console bundle unboxing and I'm going to be showing you guys everything you're going to be getting in the box when you pick this up on launch if you're going to be getting it. So looking at the front here we can see the uh, Xbox One console, this is what it's going to look. We're going to take a much deeper and in-depth look at this once we open the box but that's what the brief look is uh, when you get the front of this console bundle. Look on the side here you've got another look at the console. We have the console and the controller which is very very nice. Taking a look at the back, we have standard artwork from the game, I'm sure you've seen this before, looks very very nice and then on this side we just have a bunch of text and stuff which isn't very important but anyway, you guys are waiting for it, let's go right into the unboxing. Alright, so let's get into this, let's take the seal off the box, so once we open it like that we need to lay it down flat like so, and then by opening up we have what we can see straight away is the Xbox One con controller. What we'll do is we'll put this down to one side just for a moment and show you what else we have inside. So opening up this little flap here, we have um, standard Xbox One manual. We have uh, a Call of Duty Advanced Warfare Want More Gear, add a second limited edition wireless controller and they've got what looks like a code for 14 days of Xbox Live Gold. Of course we won't show that, we'll pop that down there. Here we have some more manuals and stuff like that which aren't very important but here's the good stuff so you get standard headset which uh, you'll need for talking on xbox live and we have standard power cables and also it looks like a hdmi cable so that's very nice here we have the uh, power brick which is very useful of course if you want to actually use the console and you get batteries of course will be useful for your controller but put all this down to one side we don't really need this here is what you guys have all been waiting for. So I'm going to very carefully take these off here. This is what the uh, controller is being protected by. And I may say it's very, very protective as well. But here we have the world's first advanced warfare Xbox One console hidden behind this. So what I'll do is I'll quickly drop the box over to one side. Place it down like that, and are you ready? Here we go, it's wrapped up very, very nicely. I'll try my best not to damage this wrapping in any way. But here we have the console right here. So if I very carefully slide this off, here we go. This is the Advanced Warfare Xbox One console. So if you take a look right on the side panels here, we have this bullet brass gold uh, disc tray right here, which looks very, very nice. We also have uh, a nice little strip along here. Uh, we'll also to note the Sentinel Task Force. These are a group that you'll find in the campaign, which you'll be playing in, which are a kind of team which aren't as wealthy as Atlas Corporation, which is the uh, character that Kevin Spacey plays. That's, that's the corporation that he's controlling. Uh, so to capture the look and feel of the Sentinel Task Force, if you look around here on top of the Xbox, there's a lot of scuffs and stuff like that, which is to kind of replicate that this Xbox has been in the battlefield and it's a little bit kind of worn out, almost a bit like the Sentinel Task Force itself. So we've got scuffs here, we've got scuffs here, here, and also around the back here, we've got um, the Sentinel Task Force logo, which is almost like a sort of gladiator helmet with wings, which looks very, very cool. And what is also very important to note here is that we also have a um, unique QR code which I will scan a little bit later on in the video to show you guys what that will lead you to. It's a very cool website and we'll get into that a little bit more into this uh, video. So just taking a look at the back in case you guys are interested. Have the standard ports as always, HDMI in, HDMI out. We've got connect, we've got ethernet, we've got USBs, power, all that stuff. And then if you want to take a quick look on the sides here, also says Call of Duty which is very very nice. And then on this side, we don't have anything. But what is to note about this console that is very unique, not only in its design, but it's also the world's first one terabyte Xbox One, which is very, very good for, for those that are looking to get Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Then uh, not only are you going to be getting a copy of the game uh, digitally, you're getting this amazing console, but you're also getting a one terabyte hard drive, which is amazing. So put this over to one side. I'm going to show you something which I've personally been looking really forward to and that is the uh, Xbox One 
Bart's Warfare controller. So if we sit that down just next to the console here so you can get a little look at that in a bit more detail, it's absolutely gorgeous. It's without a doubt my favourite Xbox One console controller design I've ever seen. So I want to pick it up here and I'll show you guys. We have the Bullet Brass D-pad right here which is captures the Bullet Brass uh, exoskeleton uh, that you get for pre-ordering. We have um, very nice kind of gold around here. We have a few kind of little secret easter eggs that have been put on here. So if you want to take a quick zoom in on here, a lot of people suspected that this was actually uh, from zombies because it's got the round markers which is round 8. doesn't have any actual um, reference to zombies in any way. It's interesting that it's there and I love the fact that it's there, but uh, we're not too quite sure what that actually uh, entails. We've got the Sentinel Task Force right there again, and also we have some scuffs right on the top of the controller there, which also kind of shows that it's a bit worn out. And uh, my favourite feature, little smiley face on the back of the controller. You can't go wrong with a little smiley face. You probably think I drew that on in Biro, but that is actually there. And then this is what it looks like from the back. But without a doubt, my favourite controller so far for uh, Xbox One. It's absolutely gorgeous. Right here we've got COD, AW, and then SHG for Sledgehammer Games. So the last thing I'm going to show you guys, and I'm actually going to put the power cable in, and I'm going to play you what this sounds like when you power the console up, when you eject a disc, and when you also power it down, because it has some very unique sounds. Mm -hmm. Like I mentioned, there's a special QR code on the top of the Xbox One. Now I've got my iPhone here, and I'm going to be uh, scanning the QR code and showing you what comes up. So I've got our QR reader here. I'm going to quickly scan the Xbox and show you what we get. So this takes you to xbox.com forward slash COD bundle to tell you a little bit more behind the scenes of what they call Project Anvil, which is the Xbox One limited edition bundle. At the moment it says available November 3rd, reserve yours today, which is when you'll be able to actually get this officially. And uh, I'll tell you guys, if you're buying it from uh, the UK, it's going to cost £429. And if you're buying it in the US, it's going to cost $499. There's a little video on here which will show you the behind the scenes of the actual console uh, design itself and what went into it, which is very, very interesting. So if you guys want to watch that, then that will be there when you scan the QR code. Then as you get more towards down, it tells you um, what you're also going to be getting with the Day Zero edition, which is... Uh, two custom weapons, the AK-12G assault rifle and the crossbow BO2. And then uh, right at the bottom here, it just got a little bit more information and uh, just tells you a little bit more about um, if you buy the bundle and you come back here on November 3rd, as our thanks, we'll have something special for you. So those that pick this up on the day, make sure you scan the QR code, go over to this website and see what there is uh, on November 3rd, because I actually have no idea what is going to be in store, but it's going to be something exciting, so make sure you check around for that. Right, guys, so welcome back. We have the console actually plugged in, and I'm going to be taking a look at the custom sounds. So it's going to sound very different to any other Xbox One that you own, because it's got custom noises when you turn it off, turn it on, and also eject the disc. So turning on the console sounds like this. Sounds absolutely beautiful. I think that's the sound of an exoskeleton actually being activated and put into power, but that could just be, uh, could be wrong. But, um, now, normally when you press the eject button, without a disc in it, it makes that noise. So what we have here is a copy of Call of Duty Ghosts. Just thought it'd be good to have a Call of Duty put into a Call of Duty console. And uh, when you eject the disc, it sounds absolutely beautiful. So let's quickly just put this in. Give that a second. And now we're going to eject it. So listen to this. That sounds absolutely beautiful. That is the sound of an exo skeleton making a jump i'm pretty sure that is a jump sound so that sounds absolutely gorgeous and then once we turn the xbox off this is probably one of the best noises listen to this so that's the sound of the warbird score streak flying away and that is just beautiful so that's what you're going to be getting when you get the xbox one advanced warfare console bundle you're going to be getting a digital copy of advanced warfare you get the console you get this beautiful controller as well and a one terabyte hard drive you can't really go wrong if you're looking to get an xbox one this is the best time to get one as this is the best design i've ever seen for an xbox one but thank you so much for watching guys drop a like rating if you enjoyed it share it around with your friends as this is the world's first unboxing of the advanced warfare xbox one bundle make sure to subscribe for more advanced warfare videos coming up to release and i'll hopefully catch you guys for another one very very soon